The Google Translate app lets you point a phone camera at a street sign, and it translates the sign for you. This is a good example of a combination of several models that is quite intuitive. One model to find the sign, another model to read the sign, to do optical character recognition on it, a third model to translate the sign, or maybe a third model to detect the language and a fourth model to translate the sign, and a fifth model to superimpose the translated text, perhaps even a sixth model to select the font to use. Smart Reply is a feature of Inbox and Gmail where the email program suggests three possible responses to received emails. This is, in my view, the most sophisticated ML model in production today. Why do you think that is? It's a sequence-to-sequence -sequence model. In other words, it takes a received email as an input and generates a response to the email as the output. And text, as we will see later in this specialization, is usually thought of as a sequence of words. The machine learning model here needs to understand a small body of text, the incoming email, and predict three dissimilar answers. We will look at sequence models in the last but one course of the specialization. We have lots of ground to cover before we get there.